Hi friends! Today I am going to um, play in makeup and even though it's kind of early we had been talking about doing a Christmas makeup collab and I thought I'll just film that one and try to piece together some stuff that make it coherent once I find out more about it and then when I sat down to do it I thought I have these can you hear them? Will they be annoying all through the video? I've had these for like several years and I usually forget about them. So I'm so happy I remembered so early. Now I'll probably have worn them in all kinds of videos that you'll see before this one ever gets posted. So I wanted to use green because, you know, Christmas. So then, you know, I have to pull out all my palettes and start swatching all the greens because I never know which one. Um, and isn't it funny how many different shades there are? are because these don't even look green once you see these greens yeah I don't know I just I thought it was interesting I thought I'd share so <laughs> um all right I'm not going to bore you with the entire hmm the entire tree entire tree what is how's that the entire tree there's a word that means all of it but I'm saying it wrong I'm not going to bore you with every aspect of me putting on the makeup. I'll just probably come back when my look is done or if I think of something clever to tell you in the middle of doing it. But I will use primer, then I'm gonna to try to do green and then I want sparkly green. And then I'm gonna probably transition it into like a black or brown, I don't know, to deepen it up on the edges. All right, let's go see what we can do. Just because I don't wanna forget, um, this Jubilee palette from Natasha Denona out of the BoxyCharm. When I got it, I did say that I felt like this one color is going to just be a great transition color for lots of looks. And I, I have found, I use it all the time. Like this, you know, whole color is that. And I just think it's the perfect color for me. Like it's not too pink. It's not too brown. It's not too dark. It's not too light. I love it. And I find that it goes with all kinds of looks. Yeah. And, um, my green right now is out of this uh, Nostalgia Ace Butte palette, and it's the theme park color, that green up in there over there. And I did um, do a different green, or just a lighter one. I haven't blended them yet. It was uh, out of this otherworldly, this little shimmerier one. That's all that I've done so far. I'll be back again. You know what I want right now, but I don't have it, is a really dark green glitter. That would be so pretty. So I need to make myself a note and look for some of that because I have like you know, this whole pinky rose palette that I tried out like this green over my swatch of glitter, but it's up here and then I tried a black too. That's not giving me the look I want. That's not the right vibe. So I'm gonna continue to look and see what else I have. Maybe like some kind of shiny thing. Or maybe I'll try like a silver or something over it. But wouldn't green look awesome? Okay, I'll be back again. Okay, so I'm actually kind of thinking I like this. Um, I've used a bunch of goofy stuff though. I have found this kind of loose shimmer green that I think I bought from Wish. And I don't suggest it really, even though I do like this because... I don't know, it ended up being way too expensive for the droplets of shadow that was in it. And it was supposed to be multi-chrome, and it definitely is not. But it's not glitter. But it's shimmer. And then I found this brown glitter I also think I got from Wish um, for the outside edge. Then I tried to use this glitter liner that I got from Shop Miss A. I also don't suggest these. Um, let's see. It is here. It looks really much better on my arm. When I just was trying to do this like little spot in the corner, I didn't love it. I kind of wish I hadn't done it because then I remembered I had like the JD Glow glitter liners and that's, I think, much prettier. So I ended up going into the corner with it and it's the Fairy Balm. Then I used that new green eyeliner that I got in the $3 add-on sale from Ipsy. I really have liked this eyeliner a lot. And I've used it. So, yeah, I'm liking it so far. And I feel like I should 
sprinkle it all together with, I guess, mascara and maybe the rest of my face. All right, let's go do that thing. Here's my final look. And look at my glitter on my lips. I thought that was kind of fun. I don't know how practical it is, but um, it's probably already on my teeth. And maybe I should have decided to try out the look on a day that I had washed my hair. That's my curtain I'm holding back. Real professional I am. Let me show you off. And I think that we're going to do maybe a look before New Year's Eve too. Just just fun little inspirations. Okay, thanks so much, and I hope you guys are having a great holiday season. Bye.